How did this mural get started? Well, uh, it started with uh, Liu's invitation. He had that uh, arranged with uh, Liz Lauer already, and uh, he was looking for a partner to help him out with the mural. And uh, we started talking um, like different ideas for for the mural, and uh, and then we partnered up to to do the mural. How did so, how did you and him meet? First of all, uh, he reached out to me. Like he was, I, I think he saw some of my stuff on online and then he invited me to uh, check out his uh, studio apartment and then I went there one day social distancing mask and stuff but like we started connecting and 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 talking we, we talked a lot like hours and, mm -hmm. and talking about our stories and what brought us to Madison and uh, and and comparing like uh, styles and, and talking about collaboration from the beginning even before talking about the actual mural and then eventually he, he he mentioned the mural and asked me if I was up to and I was like yes definitely I would love to collab on that yeah and how did you guys come up with the design that you ended up using on the wall um, Lubov already wanted to do a mural that would uh, show his um, uh, pattern style that he's been uh, throwing around at the mattresses and his uh, paintings like he has a, a pretty consistent um, pattern style and he wanted to do a mural like showing that as well but he wanted also to have something of a message like a lettering uh, within that mural and this is my my expertise so I was like let's try to come up with a message and something in there at first we even consider having a mural that would uh, show the word Monroe because of Monroe Street, but then eventually we switched that to Madison, and it was like, okay, so we got this big word. Let's try to think of ways to to represent that word in a in a more interesting, unique way. And then I was looking for references on the uh, sign painting style that it's it's quite popular on the river uh, on the boats in the Amazon region in Brazil. So it's like they, they have like a, a sign painting style, which is something that were, that is extremely popular when you have boats and you sign paint the name of the owner, yeah. the family, et cetera. And this is something that became also popular in the Amazon region, but it somehow it is like it got twisted a little. So like some of the details and the way you would include uh, patterns inside the letters, for example, or the 3D or the gradient. These are all things that I was I was looking into, and it's uh, it, it become it became like something uh, something of a reference to to use on the on this project. And because I'm from Brazil, you is from Mexico, we wanted to make a mural that had uh, Latin America influences, and I was looking at the Amazon region as a reference. Mm -hmm. 